Good morning. Welcome to the forecast discussion for Tuesday, April 18th, 2023. Of course, I'm your meteorologist, Stephen Martino. It's a bit chilly and windy out there this morning, with temperatures ranging from the upper 30s to mid 40s over the northern interior, upper 40s to lower 50s in your suburbs, and lower to mid 50s in your urban areas and down to our southern New Jersey. It's a bit breezy out there with winds from the west southwest around 5 to 15 miles per hour, but at times gusting as high as 25 miles per hour. Those winds will subside as we go on through the morning hours, and by the afternoon, generally not too bad. Winds from the west around 5 to 15, but it's certainly going to put a bit of a nip in the air this morning. When we take a look at our latest surface map and radar, a lot of this is not reaching the ground. We have a report of a few snow showers back towards central Pennsylvania, but this thus far is just scattered broken cloud cover and that tells you just how much dry air is in place now we're going to be keeping an eye on the potential for an isolated shower here and there throughout the day but rainfall amounts would be struggling to reach a tenth of an inch out of this so really not expecting all that much not too much of a danger really now when you take a look at the infrared satellite picture i think you could tell there's a lot of cold air aloft here with an impressive upper level low that's going to be spinning through the St. Lawrence River Valley and heading towards New England, northern New England, basically Maine, and then heading out towards the Canadian Maritimes. And while doing so, it's going to continue to keep us rather chilly and conditions unsettled with scattered broken cloud cover and a threat for that isolated shower at least through tomorrow afternoon. After that, well, I think you're going to like the end of this week with tranquil conditions and above normal temperatures. So let's dive into this forecast for today. Sky cloud cover is expected with an isolated shower here and there, a bit breezy, especially in the morning, with high temperatures ranging from the mid to upper 40s over the northern interior, lower to mid 50s along the coast, upper 50s to lower 60s in the Delaware River Valley. For tonight into tomorrow morning, look for sky cloud cover with Temperatures falling back into the lower to mid 30s over the northern interior, upper 30s to lower 40s along the coast. For tomorrow afternoon, look for sky cloud cover with an isolated shower possible. Temperatures will range from the upper 50s to lower 60s over the northern interior, lower to mid 60s along the coast, and mid 60s in the Delaware River Valley. On Thursday, high pressure will be in complete control with tranquil conditions and warmer conditions as well, with low temperatures in the upper 30s to lower 40s and high temperatures ranging from the upper 50s to mid 60s on Long Island, mid to upper 60s along the rest of the coast, upper 60s to lower 70s over the northern interior, and lower to mid 70s in the Delaware River Valley. If we get enough mixing, we might actually see a few upper 70s down towards Philadelphia and southwestern New Jersey. On Friday, beautiful day, high pressure and control, summer-like. Low temperatures will range from the upper 40s to lower 50s over the northern interior, mid 50s along the coast. High temperatures will range from the Upper 60s to mid 70s on Long Island, mid to upper 70s on the immediate coast everywhere else, upper 70s to lower 80s over the northern interior, and mid to upper 80s in the Delaware River Valley. So a very much summer-like day. On Saturday, a cold front will approach with a trough producing the threat for an isolated shower or two. We're going to hold off on the precipitation, but it's definitely going to be a bit breezy out there with Temperatures on Saturday ranging from the lower to mid 50s for lows and high temperatures ranging from the lower to mid 60s on Long Island, upper 60s to lower 70s along the coast, and lower to mid 70s everywhere else. Now on Sunday, the cold front is going to move through with widespread showers and thunderstorms. And some of those thunderstorms could be rather strong, so we're going to have to keep an eye on that to see how that evolves. A lot of factors will come to play. Timing of the cold front development of a secondary low pressure system and also the vertical wind shear but overall it looks like sunday is going to be your stormier day of the weekend so definitely be prepared for that look for low temperatures to range from the mid 40s to lower 50s and high temperatures to range from the upper 50s to mid 60s on monday high pressure will build in with sky cloud cover still can't rule out an isolated shower with a trough or two look for lows in the lower to mid 40s high temperatures will range from the upper 40s to lower 50s over the northern interior 
mid 50s to lower 60s along the coast and on tuesday look for sky cloud cover throughout the region can't rule out an isolated shower with this little trough hanging around here but for the most part tranquil conditions are expected with low temperatures ranging from the lower to mid 30s over the northern interior upper 30s to lower 40s along the coast high temperatures in the mid to upper 40s over the interior lower to mid 50s along the coast that's your forecast discussion for today have a wonderful day and as always stay safe out there